Well, let's go for another run. It will be the pilot this time. So, do we have anything new? Oh, you're new. Since our little business arrangement has been turning a profit, I thought I might expand my inventory a bit. So, yeah, you, you were a merchant, actually. Let me know what you need, and I'll get it added to my stock. But I need to buy it, though. Why would I just buy it if I can just get some, unlock some stuff that I might get for free later? Isn't it better? Oh, you're also new. Hello again, Doug's Traveling Emporium is back. Get a load of my quality wares. But same idea, though. Do I even care? I don't know. Not so sure about that. Also, I can interact with this thing, apparently. A statue in memory of a great bullet. So judging by the fact that it requires Prime Primer as one of the things, I assume that is uh, there to track progress in terms of how many items I was able to collect for my quest. Okay. Maybe. So yeah, can I still, like, buy some stuff there? Yes, I can. So let's just do that then. Heart per sounds good. Guns, maybe. Yeah, okay, let me just buy guns and then heart purse as well. And I don't really have anything else, enough money to buy anything else. We'll get there eventually though, but like HP is the most relevant thing for me right now, so that sounds definitely decent. And um, so I have a lockpick. What else do I have? Lockpick. Yes, I do remember about the lockpick. What is the chance, though? Regardless, reduces prices at shops and also increases active item capacity and maximum ammo counts. So, um, if I remember correctly, that means I can hold two active items. And I also have more ammo, apparently. And that might be useful. That is a nasty room, by the way. For the first floor. Okay. Oh, there's a key! There's a key. I'll not be able to get to that. No, it's way too far. No, 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 no. Not happening. I can't even kill it. Like, I don't have guns. So... Unfortunate, but yeah. More of them? Not of them, no. But there is a bullet. Is that it, though? One more. And then there is also a book to my left. Done? Done. Boss room already. Well, I want like at least one gun before I get there. And the chest. Interesting. Uh, I will use my lockpick because um, I should have like at least one more chest on this level guaranteed, right? So I might as well just try to open this one. Because uh, even if I use my natural keys, I might just not have enough of them. So I might as well just use the lockpick. Oh, actually worked. Shock rifle zap. That actually sounds pretty decent. Uh, what do we have in the merchants, though? 55. So I assume it's just plus 1 HP, most likely. Can I interact with you? Probably not. Okay, uh, 55... I don't know. 4 HP? I mean, it's, it's a good idea, probably, but... I might need this money for unlocking some stuff later. Like the shortcut, for example, for the elevator. Fixing the elevator. 
will uh, require quite a lot of money. I'm not sure I will be doing that, though, in this run, but, you know, might be. Well, that was easy. Do I want to just use my lockpick again? I think at this point, yes. Because I already have a gun, so it's not that big of a deal even if it fails. And the same idea, like, I can still just use my, um... Ring of Mick Friendship. I can still, uh, use those keys for the... Shortcut unlock, at the very least. Makes chest safer. Oh, not actually a ring, but rather a small creature pretending to be a ring. Emits a strange psychic tone only recognizable to mimics, preventing them from attacking. I've never seen a mimic. So that's a thing. And it does... it prevents them from being mimics. Well, good to know, I suppose. <laughs> that never was a problem before, but apparently it could be a problem. Okay. Okay, then. Okay, so, can we like... No, 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 but, but, no, oh, come on. Can we get somewhere else, though? Should have switched to the gun, uh, to the shock rifle, I guess. It just seems wrong to switch to the shock rifle to another gun on the first floor, you know? Because uh, it seems a bit too early for that, but probably was a good call in that room. Can I, like, get away? Okay, what was that? He can throw it? What's up with that? Oh my god. Maybe it's not that he can throw it, but it's more that I can actually break the chain and then it flies in my direction. Maybe that's a thing. So I think I should just continue using my lockpick. Wow, that's crazy. Three of them worked. Glass cannon. Fragile fatal. What? What? Powerful but shatters upon taking damage. Normally, a gun made of glass would shatter instantaneously, but the Gungeon's energies have reinforced this inadvisable device to the point of near usability. Uh, so I can't take damage? I see. And then it reloads automatically. Okay. Well, I see the point. I'll try to use it, I guess. Not in the normal rooms, however. nasty. Okay, I should actually switch to my shock rifle at this point. Something like this. I don't think I can do anything with this fireplace with my current setup, so just continue then. Nothing else on the floor. So if I go to merchant, can I buy anything? It would just be hard purse pretty much, and I can't buy it, so no. The answer is no. Let's go then, and I think I will use glass cannon. Well, yes. Well, I should start with it, actually. Let's just go. Okay, let's not do that. Can we switch, actually, at this point? Well, actually spent two blanks. Uh, second blank was uh, misclick. But 
it's okay if I can just clear the room. So do I actually get the HP from that? Yeah, I do. Well, that was worth it then. Even though the second one was a misclick, that is worth it. And that's a new gun. Origani Thousand Cuts. Any interesting... Anything interesting in description? This gun incredibly enough has been folded entirely out of paper. Only a true master gunsmith could create something this elegant. Well, I get the idea, but like... I see. Seems pretty random. The way it flies, but... Hmm. Okay. Okay. Well, um... Doesn't seem to be very useful. So for now, I think I'm just using shock rifle, I guess. No more keys, no more nothing. I can buy plus one HP, but at this point, I'm not even sure if I need it, really. Just continue, I think. I will go with the uh, shock rifle. And I always can just switch to my starting gun if I need it, but at least start with that. Okay. Oh, joy. Okay. Manageable. Not a big fan of that enemy. Okay. Now we can actually just switch to the starting weapon. And that should be good enough. Ow! Oh, come on. Like, I assumed the wall would be just smooth. With no, you know, nothing to get stuck on. But that's not the case there in this room. Didn't even, like, look at it. Just assumed I would be able to, uh slide along it with no issues. I should switch to shock rifle. Okay. In fact, I can... Um, oh. <laughs> Rolled a bit too late. I can actually switch to glass cannon. And I can just one-shot it. And switch back immediately. Okay, what is this? Why are there, like... Why are there reinforcements? Oh, come on, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. As if that enemy wasn't enough. Where's the last one? Okay. So, I guess I should still keep using the shock rifle. I'm not actually that big of a fan of my setup currently. Oh well, oh well. Oh. Okay. I probably can just roll... Like, uh... Through the pit. I don't really need to roll through those flames. Regardless. Works for me. Blank is good. That's a lot of blanks. How do I get uh, so many blanks? Didn't I spend, like, all of them? In the boss fight. So, I think I should just use my lockpicks again. It worked again! What's up with that? Hegemony Carbine. All the same. Ooh. That looks pretty good. I should uh, just spend all of my shock rifle then, I guess. Can I do anything with that? Nope. Okay. Oh well. Okay. Might get hit there. Didn't. I think I should either buy the Prime Primer this time. Or, I should buy the... or unlock the shortcut. What is this? 
laser rifle. Laser rifle is... Uh, is it the same weapon that I've used in one of my runs? It is good. But I have a lot of uh, decent guns already. I think I can just ignore it. So yeah, I'm not sure if I will go for the prime primer or if it will be a shortcut instead. I think I should, I should actually probably just get the shortcut done. Well, let's see. I'm not even sure if I'll get enough money for that, so we'll see. It's just the problem is uh, I don't really even need shortcut. I assume at least it will be a shortcut, but like I don't even need a shortcut anyway because um, I will probably not use it even. But it's just so difficult to unlock it normally, like 3 keys and 120 money I think it was. Like at least I have an opportunity to do it right now, and I'm not sure if I will have that opportunity in the future. Because that's a lot of resources, so I might as well just unlock it while I can. That was it? There was nothing in this room, come on. Yeah, just use the lockpick again. It worked? What is the sorcery? Should the cola speed up? Speed up of what? Highly caffeinated, save the cap. Speed up of what? Of myself? Yeah, I guess uh, my speed got a bit higher. Maybe. Who are you? Or you're just an eye. That's okay. Oh, there's one more. Let's actually deal with that first. Okay. And now we can uh, do something about this guy. Is it dead? There's nothing again. Oh well. Some healing, and I can buy at least a uh, Prime Primer for sure. Now I can also buy the shortcut. So I still have some ammo for this thing. Okay, I should switch away from it, I guess, at this point. Just use the Carbine. And I think I will actually unlock the shortcut. I have the exact money for it. So honestly, might as well. Yeah. Hell yeah, you can. Thanks, I'll go buy the parts. That's most of the parts taken care of. Oh my god, more. But I'm going to have to order something special from the acquisitions department. Can you bring bring me 10 credits? Oh. Well, that, that wasn't the part of the deal, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, so the bullet that is required for the... That is given for the completion of the first uh, boss unharmed. I can give you this thing, yes. Uh, credits, I'm not so sure though. Okay, I will, I will. So... I will need to do it at some point, that's my logic, right? If I need to do it at some point anyway, I might as well just do it now. Why not? Just get it over with. And about 10 credits, I'm not so sure. We'll see. If I can get, like, this boss done with, uh... And get some credits from him. Oh, oh my god! What is happening? What is happening? Okay, I see what is happening. I see what is happening. This gun is not strong enough. Uh... Okay, I need to switch to the glass cannon, I think. Just use that. Okay. And it just broke immediately. <clears throat> yep. Well, the good thing is... The good thing is that I uh, gave my keys and my money. And also the trophy for the first uh, floor. So, we can just restart and, like, be happy about it, right? Well, not not as this... Well, actually, let, no, it's fine. Let's continue as this character. That's fine. At least uh, some things were accomplished in this run, even though died pretty early. 
I didn't like remember any of those attacks from the boss. I think uh, even though I fought him, I guess he just died too quickly before, so it was all like very new to me for some reason. Okay, more. Not too bad for now. I think in this run, most likely, I will have to use uh, my keys, though. Instead of lockpick. Well, we'll see. It went pretty well previously, but I think I just got very lucky with it, so this time I will use keys and my might even skip some chests. Cause I can't really rely on my lockpick working that well anymore. Ammo synthesizer, ammo chance on kill. Sounds very good. Repurposes spent ammo from fallen gun dead. Well, okay, so just chance to drop some ammo when you kill stuff. Sounds really good. Don't really have any guns to use it on though. I like that enemy. Drops a lot of money all the time. Do I just open it normally? I feel like while I have keys, yes, probably. I also don't have any guns. Void shotgun. Okay, I'm familiar with this one. So yeah, while I don't have any guns and I have a surplus of keys anyway, might as well just open it normally. Can't really do anything with this fireplace again, I think. Okay. Three paths. This should lead me towards the item room eventually. Oh, can we not do that? Okay. Okay. Well, didn't get damaged. Somehow. One more room, huh? Okay. And I think I should still be using my key. Normally. Magic sweet free stats. So I saw HP. Is there some something more than that? Yeah, health, movement, speed, and damage. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Okay. Sounds really good. Do I need to open the door, by the way? Like, does it do anything? Probably not. Why is it even there if I can just teleport? And the merchant, finally. Do we have anything interesting? Not sure. Crestfaller. So that's the freezing gun. I do remember it. Mm. Heavy boots. I should buy it, probably. Just 30 money. That's very cheap. No idea what it does, though. Low center of mass. Allows a gunjineer to keep their footing even when great force is applied to them. So just reduces knockback done on you. Whatever. 
Probably just use Void Shotgun in this fight. Probably also taking damage. We'll see how that goes. Oh, used blank. Didn't really wanted to do that, but oh well. Okay. That should be enough, I think. Oh. Well, that is enough. Well, the blank was a mistake, but... At least I got it done with no HP loss, so I'm happy about that. What is this? A Gemini Rifle. So I had Carbine previously, and now it's a Rifle. I should probably use it in normal rooms. How many credits do I have, by the way? Can I see it? Okay, I can. So I can actually pay for the elevator now. Should have thought about, like, buying some stuff, but I can't really buy that much. Um, I could have bought the um, gun. But, oh well. Oh well. So, do you still need the credits? Well, I do have it. Yes. Yes. Is that it, though? That's everything. Meet me in the bridge when you're done here. Okay, so that should be done, then. I... I will not even use it, most likely, but okay, okay, at least that part is done. Can just switch. Can switch back after that. I will actually use uh, my better guns for now, because I do have um, passive for dropping ammo crates sometimes. Okay. Carefully. Oh. Wait, what is this? What is happening? This thing is not precise at all, by the way. Can just spam it though, so it's not that big of a deal. Oh my god, I see. I didn't even think it would be able to cross the pit. Is that it? Okay. Can just switch now. Um, I should still use the rifle, I think. Can use shotguns later. So, I might need those keys yet. But I might as well... Let's just use the lockpick, actually. Oh, still works. Hexagon. So that's the sniper rifle, right? If I remember correctly. Um, can use it sometimes in some rooms, but normally I should just go in with the rifle, though. Anything? Nope. Okay, well, I can definitely switch now. Um, shotgun? Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh yes. Okay. I guess lockpick, yeah. Okay. Can I still open it? No. Okay. Back to the rifle then.
What is happening? Can I kill the shark? Now I can switch, actually. How many bullets do I still have for the rifle? 150, pretty much. I'm pretty sure I can just... No, 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 no. I should just kill it uh, safely with other guns. This is not too bad, though. Can definitely switch to my starting weapon now. And let's see the merchant. What do we have? Lil Bomber. Uh, I don't know about that. I can try to get Prime Primer. We'll see. I probably will not have enough money for that, though. So, probably nothing in the shop. But we'll see. Oh, he's just dead. Just dead. That was a decent room. What? Actually, wait. <laughs> what about the sniper rifle? Oh. Can't really aim with it very well. It's okay, though. It's not too bad. I can just... Uh Keep my distance with it. That's what I like about it. This guy doesn't seem very dangerous if you can just keep your distance. So that's a good weapon for it. Oh, there is a cell. And a lot of money, actually. A lot of money. Hell yeah. And even an ammo box. For the shotgun, I suppose. That's like a very decent assortment of weapons, by the way. Not very strong weapons by themselves, but like... Short distance with the shotgun, long distance with the hexagon, and then uh, middle distance with, uh, with the rifle. What is this? What is, what is happening? What is happening? Can I interact with this? Dark energy permeates the shrine. Remain or leave? Ah, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Remain? <laughs> oh, just some optional challenge fight? I suppose. Can we, like, get the shotgun, please? Oh. Oh. Just kill the slime. Okay, fine. And then kill this thing. Is it done? No more. Well, I assume there would be more, yeah. Makes sense. Oh no, oh no, oh that's bad, oh that's bad. Okay, I will get hit there, yes. <laughs> There's no, nothing I can do about it, let's be real. <laughs> that's ridiculous. So you get a lot of money for it and the chest. Well, if you always get a chest, then uh, that's actually really good. And this might be better, in fact, than my rifle for normal rooms, so I'm glad I did that. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no. How did I not get hit there? That's ridiculous. Well, I didn't. And the boss room. Let's explore this room first. There should be a cell somewhere. Two hits, by the way, from this weapon. Well, with my, like, passive upgrade for damage, I think it's this run, right? Where I have it. The thing that increases your damage, among other things. Yes, this one. Free stats. Magic Sweet, by the way. Should remember that. If I see it in the shop or something like that. Uh, I don't know. Just... I can use a lockpick. I'm not sure if I should, like, save my keys. But I might as well just use lockpick, honestly. Because, uh, I don't know, it's not like I really need anything right now. Hello. It's about time someone stopped by. Name's Frifel. Got surrounded and before you know it, the cowards had us trapped. Thanks for the help. Ah, wonderful. You might have heard of me. I'm known as the Grey Mauser. No? 
Regardless, my headstrong companion here was be beginning to be get bored. My thanks. Come see us if you want to hunt. What? What? Upstairs. Okay, so it's something uh, back in the... Don't remember how the place is called. Breach, I think. Nothing else on the floor. So, I can still buy something. I mean, I might as well just buy the Prime Primer. And let's just go. So the boss fight, ideally, I think I should just use... Maybe shotgun? It depends on the boss. If I can get closer than shotgun, yeah. From the longer distance, let's try the hexagon, actually. See how that goes. Well, that's actually a shotgun enemy. That's a shotgun enemy. Let's actually switch. Uh, for this... Okay. Okay. That's ridiculous. Ow. Oh, okay. I see. Can you die? You're still not dead after two shotgun blasts. Seriously. I can't really get closer then. Should just switch to the sniper rifle, probably. No, actually, should switch to Void Marshal, maybe? Ow. That's a lot of damage. That was unnecessary. Can you just die? That was a lot of HP. Well, survivable for now, though. For now, it's survivable. Ammo for Void Marshal, probably. And camera. What does that do? Why? So it's a gun, obviously. A camera brought to the dungeon by a journalist. This, the camera is shaped enough like a gun to survive in the gungeon's depths. No idea. Maybe it just freezes them or something. Was it an Isaac that was a concept like this? I don't actually remember. There was, in some game, there was a concept of uh, camera freezing stuff. I think it was Isaac. So I can't really buy health. Can't get health from my bank. There is none. Can't buy health. Don't have money for it, so I guess I should just continue then. Uh, yeah. Well. I can. Not too happy about it, though. Though, realistically, like, 3 full HP is not too bad. It's just that I could have 2 more. That's true. I see. Well, not too bad. Okay. Not a big fan of that. Can actually deal with you with my normal gun. Let me actually... Uh, no, 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 no. Let me check the camera. I'm not sure. I don't think it does any damage, though. It does damage. It does damage in AoE. Interesting. Very difficult to use, though. If it doesn't one-shot even the weakest enemies, it's not really reliable enough so that you can uh, use that in rooms like this one, for example. What is even happening? Oh my god, come on. What is happening there? What is this? What is this? Can you just die? Is that it? Okay. Well, no idea what was happening. But it isn't happening anymore. That's good enough for me. What is this? What are we doing? Why? Why? 
Oh, nothing. Okay. Should switch at this point. Um, I guess should still w use Void Marshal. I can't really proceed there. Can you, like, come to me? Like this, yes. Okay. That's good enough. And that's it. So this should be an item room. Honestly, might as well just use my keys. Like lockpicks, I only need lockpicks to um, save my keys, right? But why would I save my keys if, I ne if I'm never using them anyway? I can at least use them when I have two of them, why not? Oh, that's a gun. What? What? Why does it have so uh, low ammo count? When this gun runs out of ammo, it is destroyed, creating a chest. So you can reroll it pretty much. Is it unlocked chest? Or is it uh, a random chest? Or what? Well, I can reroll it, I guess. If it's a locked chest, though, well, I can just use my lockpick then. Let's actually try using it. I don't know if it's that useful normally. Okay. Uh, shotgun. How is it still alive? It's not alive anymore. Okay. Makes sense then. How do I get the mage? Healing is relevant. And then it's either Void Marshal or it's a Shotgun. I think it should be a Shotgun actually. And I will continue using Void Marshal. For now. How much is this? How much money is this? 35, okay. Well, I've seen this one before, but no idea if it will go well this time or not. This one did, but the rest is worse. So this seems pretty random to me, so I can shoot like this green thing, right? And then it wouldn't be good. Something like this, maybe? No. Actually, it's good enough. How do you shoot at the thing at the bottom? Okay, that seems very random. At least I can uh, pretty consistently hit the middle one. If I just am being careful about it. Like, at least in two shots, right? It should be fine. At least. I'm still not sure what to do about the bottom one, though. Do I just open it? It seems like a good chest. <laughs> I don't really want to break it. Yeah, let's just open it normally. Machine fist. Avalanche of bullets. Interesting. Gold junk unlocked. Okay. Well, uh, that seems like an interesting gun. I should probably use it, but for now, though, let's actually use the directional pad to the fullest. Why did, like... Oh, it was unlocked already, I think. That's why I still have my key. Okay. I don't like this gun. No, it's okay. It's okay. No, it's actually okay. I don't mind it. It shoots in bursts of four, and then you can't actually keep shooting. You need to, uh... 
press the button again and again, but... It's not a problem, really. It's okay. Need to kill this thing. Okay, can we, like, deal with that stuff? Thank you. What about the ammo box? With Void Marshal, maybe? Sounds good. And try to get to the merchant somehow. So... I should... I'll just keep using the directional pad, I think. Not in this room, though. Mm, I have no idea. Just use maybe, like, maybe the camera somehow? Can I just kill them like this? Okay. Respawn. Uh, not camera, probably. Just D-pad, I guess. So what should I use the... Potentially... Actually, the rifle should be good enough. Not really confident enough uh, to use my starting gun in this room yet. It looks complicated, so let's just, you know, be extra safe. Okay. Not good. Shotgun. Ow. Didn't get hit, I think. Okay, so how about we use just the sniper rifle, for example, or something? Hexagon. Does it, like, turn them into critters? Can transmogrify foes. Yeah, I guess so. So it just kills them, then. So this is, uh... Bullet, previously, I think. Supposed to be shotgun kin in the past. So I can get to the merchant now. Let's normally keep using the D pad. It was this round that I have a prime primer, right? Yeah, so I still have that. I just need to get to uh, floor 5. Pretty tall order, though. We'll see how that goes. 34 armor, 24 for half heart. Well, I should buy it, I guess, at some point. But for now, though, I can just continue. I can buy it later. We'll see how it goes with money. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, you're a merchant, obviously. Can't really buy anything. Bottle? Bottle allows you to, like, stockpile some things for later. Probably not. Potion of lead skin. Ah, uh, no idea. And this is a gun, probably, right? Yeah, so... Potion is probably some sort of a usable item that just... I don't know. Maybe add some extra protection. For like one shot or something. Okay. Uh, how about we don't do that? Can I even kill it? Oh my god. What the- what, what is even happening? What is happening there? What is happening? Am I supposed to kill the enemies or what? Who are you? Are you an enemy? You are an enemy. So this thing is dead now. Okay, good. Now, those will fire at me. They will fire at me. Eventually they will. Ow. Ah, god damn it. No, there is still- Ah! Interesting. 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 Okay, so I was able to actually snatch it back. Can you do something with the rat then? If you get there quickly enough? Huh. Not sure. Should remember about that though. So, I'll use a lockpick. Nope. Ah, 
Hi. An ominous fountain filled with blood. It isn't quite full. Make a sacrifice, lose HP, I guess, yeah? What is that? Is it something? No. Can I advance now, where I wasn't able to before? Is that something new? Like, the room isn't, but maybe... Well, I can't really go anywhere. I'm pretty sure I will not be able to make through that pit. So... Oh, lose like one max HP, you mean? The spirits that once inhabited this shrine have departed. No idea what that was all about. Huh. I don't see what I'm supposed to do there, though. Can't really activate anything. There is potentially this platform. I could try to get there. But even then, I'm not... I'm pretty sure I would not be able to get onto that rail. So... I don't know. I don't think so. Well, I think the best idea there is just to buy more HP, honestly. Sounds boring, but I think that is uh, the best thing for me. Yeah, I can do it later, though. I don't really have to do it right now. I can just proceed into the boss fight. I have enough HP. Let's go. Oh, it's different now. Oh, I see how it works. Okay. Okay, then. Okay, then. Oh. Was that something that I acquired from my sacrifice? Some sort of uh, drain. That I do... Oh, oh, two nearby enemies now. Oh, god damn it. Let's not do that. Should switch to the shotgun, probably. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, did lose HP. Not too much, though. How much money do I have? 48. Is that it? Save it, yes. And what is this? Alien engine, the danger zone. What the hell? What does it do? The engine of a crashed starship that has been converted into an energy weapon. What? What? Need to test it. So the question is... What would allow me to get to the boss more consistently? I think the most consistent way is just to get the armor. Not to the boss, but like to the floor 5 specifically. I think I should just get armor and that's it. Because I just need to get to um, floor 5. To get rid of the prime primer at least. Yeah, okay. And I can't really do anything else on this floor, so let's go. I'll test this gun first of all and see how that goes. Is this like a close range weapon or what? Or what? Or what? I did get a blank, by the way. Wait, are they fully recharged? Up to two? Every floor? Huh. I see. It's very short range, but it just kills things. Good to know.
What do I do though? I'm not even sure. Void Marshal probably. Also, can you just die? Thank you. Oh, also, not a big fan of that. Like this thing. Oh, oh, oh. How did I not get hit there? That's ridiculous. I think that drain thing is what I gained from the sacrifice. Seems like it, at least. No idea what's up with that. You know what I can do? I can potentially, like, try to shoot far, and maybe there is something by the end of it that I can break or something. Like, hit. Like, if you have a gun, for example, that has a sufficient range to get through. Something like that. It doesn't seem like it, though. At least not with this gun. Okay. So, get my Void Marshal back. Alright. Where's the summon? I don't know, but there's a lot of stuff happening. Okay. No idea how I didn't get hit there. Can you just die? Can you just die? That's good. Void Marshal is pretty good, by the way. Uh, not a big fan of that. Decent, though. Also, not a big fan of this thing. Can we not... Done. I still have enough ammo for at least one more room. So shouldn't have any issues. Can I just kill this thing, please? I like... I just get damaged so much. What? What was that? Why was it there? Hey, okay, this thing is dead. Can I actually just switch to the shotgun? Oh! Oh! Need to kill this thing. Okay, well, some HP actually. Do I have more ammo? Yeah, I do have more ammo. Should be able to handle one more room. Oh, uh, shotgun, 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 shotgun. Okay, okay, well. Actually, my sound cut out. Not sure what's up with that. Need to check if the recording is still going. Okay, one moment. Yeah, the recording still uh, seems to be doing fine. Okay, then. So, Void Marshal. I'll still use it for a little bit, at least. Can't really use that anymore. So, what is happening in this room, even? What is this? Doesn't seem too bad. What do I use in, like, normal rooms? D-pad again, maybe?
should probably use something else at this point. And then switch back to D-pad, I guess. Oh, that's just the way back. Okay. So what do I do there? I do need to kill the summoner. Well, that's fine then. Because this thing is easily killable as well. Three ways. Should still continue through that door, I suppose. So, switch to the D-pad. I will use it fully. And then we'll uh, think about it. Use the lockpick. Nope. Yeah. I don't know. Did I? Can't you actually... Um, wasn't there a button to drop your... How did you get to, like, options, maybe? Controls? Like, can you see the... Um, I don't remember controller bindings. Wasn't there a button to, like, drop your items? Drop gun, drop item. You can actually do that. So, let's say I just hold up. Does that do anything? Doesn't seem like it. So, can I drop my guns then, maybe? Uh, like, for example... Like, camera, let's say. Was it down or up? Up? Okay, and this one is down. Okay, okay, so you can actually give it guns. Interesting. Uh, well, fine. I don't really want to give anything else, though, but I'll keep that in mind. That's good to know. So, I should just use the D-pad for now. And let's continue. So, what else is there? I don't like this much. Can I actually just use my shotgun? Or a rifle. Rifle is also okay. Also, so does this damage them? Okay. Doesn't seem like I can drain it. I just wanted to test if I can drain it or not. To death. But it doesn't seem like I can do it with this enemy at least. Well, so get back to my D-pad. Oh no, oh no. I think at this point I'll just use this D-pad fully. Summon the chest. Doesn't seem like it has any sort of a lock, so I can just open it normally. Reload stone. Magnetic north. Active item. Briefly absorbs enemy bullets and converts them to ammo. Oh, that sounds complicated. Sounds complicated. I mean, let's try to use it, I suppose. Maybe not on this enemy, though. Hey, that's pretty bad. Like, I actually planned on trying that active item, but was a bit too dicey to do that. Oh, okay. So while the um, animation is going, I can actually be safe. 
but after that... Oh, I see. I see your point. This gun is so bad. No accuracy, no damage. Not a lot of fire rate as well. Well, ammo is incredible, actually. I should just use it on my Void Marshal, then. Yes. Yes, please. And continue. Wow. Shocked that there were no reinforcements. Hello. Okay, <laughs> okay then. How did that happen? I was behind the wall. What? Okay. Okay. Where's the merchant? I'll just use my key, whatever, at this point. Just get something. Hot lead, chance to ignite. Well, I guess it's self... Uh... Yeah, okay. I still need to find the merchant. I see the merchant. Ow! Didn't disappear quickly enough. Well, just get my stuff, please. Just get my stuff. I have a lot of stuff. Just get, like, all of it. I had more, no? I thought I had more. Shell... Mustache. I think I should just buy some HP, really. And that's about that. I don't really need that stuff yet. Okay. Let's just go. I just need to survive the boss, really. That's it. Well, and then be able to actually uh, get to the forge quest after that. That's also a thing. Well, that's the boss. So I can't really do that much anymore. I can, like, buy some stuff, potentially, but there is nothing. Like a key? Why? Blanks? I have a lot of blanks. No, I don't think so. Should just go for it. So what am I using for the boss? Oh, I should have probably reloaded the machine fist. It's pretty good. I can just use a shotgun. It depends on what the boss is. What is the plan? What is the plan? Maybe just fully use Void Marshal? No, I'll need it for the next floor. There's no good plan there. I guess I can just use Hexagon. Oh. oh, I don't know. Maybe the rifle. It depends on the boss. Uh, shotgun, maybe. Shotgun for this fight. I don't know if the rifle is really good enough. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Can we not do that? Thank you very much. Okay, that's ridiculous. I'll just die there. I need to do something. Shotgun maybe. Can't even uh, get close enough. Yeah, well. Not surprised. Well. Oh, and I'm just dead. 
Well, that wasn't good enough this time. Didn't really, wasn't able to get the prime primer there. Oh well, I'm, I'm actually not sure what I should have used for this fight. Like, shotgun wasn't really good enough. Obviously, with good enough mechanics, you still can do it even with the shotgun. I think it just, um, I think the main mistake was just that I didn't reload the fist. Like, the fist would be a better choice, I think. Or just get better. Just get better and then you can still maybe do it with a shotgun. Well, anyway, I'll uh, end it there for now. So, for now, thanks for watching and we'll continue in the next one.